on the next Kill Count. Let's say you own the rights to a popular horror character, but you've already adapted all the books about him into movies. <laughs> There's only one thing to do. Force the author to rush out a crappy prequel novel that you can turn into a crappy prequel film. Hannibal Rising gives us a Hannibal backstory we never asked for and turns him into the hero of the story. Oh. oh, that's easy. Just add Nazis. We watch as a young Hannibal has his first brush with cannibalism. Then he grows up into an annoying edgelord who has the hots for his aunt. She's a step aunt, if that makes it any better. And she's hot for him too. At least until he starts his people eating. Hannibal Rising features forced references to the earlier better films. Even have a thing with a mask? Are, are you f***ing kidding me? Come on! Worse are the boring villains and the constant repetition of names. But hey, might as well experience this train wreck for yourself. So this week, watch Kid Hannibal kill people with a samurai sword. I'm not even joking. But on Friday, tune in for the kill count. Where? Only on Dead Meat.